<clears throat> hey, what's up guys? Fabio here once again, and I want to welcome everybody back to another video, and uh, I'm not going to do the usual stuff today. I just kind of want to get down to the point here. Um, of course, as we all know, uh, Ray Liotta has passed away, so I just wanted to take a few moments uh, to come on here and uh, just share a few words about the man and, and his work and, um, you know, pay my respects uh, to him. Um, but I always enjoyed Ray Liotta's work. Of course, uh, Goodfellas, I think, you know, was probably the biggest movie that he was in. And that was the one that, um, I would say that was the one that turned him into a star. I mean, he was in Field of Dreams the year before. He was starting, to, he was in Something Wild a couple of years before that. So, you know, he was coming up on his own, but I think Goodfellas elevated him um, to stardom. Now, I will say that I always thought that Ray Liotta was underrated, and I don't think, unfortunately, I don't think he got as good of, good of a run as he should have. Um, I don't know if that was a personal choice. I don't know if he just had bad representation or the, you know, the powers that be or whatever, but I don't know. I've just always felt that Ray Liotta was a pretty underrated leading man. Um, and I don't know, again, why he didn't have a bigger career in that respect. Um, that's just my opinion, but he, you know, he was always good. Even if the movie wasn't that good, you know, I think that he always delivered a good performance and he tried to do the best that he could with whatever material he was working with. Um, you know, again, Goodfellas was definitely the biggest movie that he was in. I would say it is his signature role. But I I would say, honestly, my favorite role that he was in was Copland, which that movie is going to celebrate its 25th anniversary in a couple of months here. But, um, you know, I, I, I kind of wish he was in that movie a little bit more, but there's just so many big names in that movie. Um, but I would say Copland is probably my favorite Ray Liotta uh, performance. That's just my opinion. But um, Dominic and Eugene was a good early role for him unlawful entry with him and Kurt Russell and Madeline Stowe. He was great in that film. Um, he was in a movie, a little independent movie called Phoenix, which is up here. You just can't see it. Uh, that was a pretty good film where he was the lead. I loved him in Wild Hogs. Um, the Many Saints of Newark, I did enjoy him in that film. It was nice to see him in a, in a big theatrical movie again. Um, you know, and again, like I keep saying, uh, No Escape. No Escape is a pretty good movie. Always enjoyed that film with him. Um, you know, again, just another underrated actor. You know, always enjoyed his work. It was always nice to see him in different projects, whether it was a movie or he would pop up in something here or there. It was always cool to see Ray Liotta. And very shocking. Um, it is very shocking to hear. Um, he was only 67. He was not old. Um... Yeah, so it was just a, a pretty shocking news day, to be honest, um, you know, to hear of the passing of Ray Liotta. But again, I have always enjoyed his work. I will continue to enjoy his work. And again, I know I keep saying it, but very shocking to hear. Very sad news. And um, may he rest in peace. So yeah, that's all I got.